This is Andy Maskin at the IPG Media Lab, and here's The Daily. Japanese researchers have developed a new accessory to build immunity to what they consider a disease of the modern age, facial recognition technology. The somewhat absurd-looking prototype goggles include near-infrared emitting lights that block face recognition cameras. For those willing to choose privacy over fashion, the glasses are getting significant attention in Japan and may retail for as low as $1 if and when they hit the market. Netflix and YouTube are taking a crack at an open screen protocol called Dial, which hopes to power second screen experiences for connected TVs, content services, and app makers. Unlike Apple's successful AirPlay, Dial will not simply mirror your mobile display, but instead can detect and launch applications on your TV. Expect a ton of new features coming to connected devices from big players like Sony and Samsung in the future. If Gangnam Style's 1.23 billion YouTube views didn't surprise you, check out the most recent revenue figures from Google. According to Chief Business Officer Nikesh Arora, Size Hit has generated $8 million in revenue on YouTube alone. With about half of that total going to the artist, YouTube can be a serious earner for content creators. Just think, Size Cut is enough to pay for a Netflix subscription for 41,000 years, with enough left over for a Fleetwood Mac box set on Amazon. For more news like this, visit ipglab.com.